New research published today in the British Journal of Psychiatry suggests that serious disorders of mood such as bipolar disorder may be the price that human beings have had to pay for more adaptive traits such as intelligence, creativity, and verbal proficiency. Scientists at the universities of Glasgow, Bristol, Cardiff, and Texas looked at data from the children of the 90s birth cohort officially called the Avon Longitudinal Study of Parents and Children ALSPAC, and found that higher childhood IQ could indicate greater risk of bipolar disorder in adulthood. ALSPAC contains information on more than 14,000 women, their partners, and offspring, which has been followed up over two decades to give insights into various aspects of health. The researchers examined data from ALSPAC to look for an association between measures of childhood IQ at age 8 and lifetime manic features assessed at 22 to 23 years. Children had both verbal IQ, VIQ, and performance IQ, PIQ, assessed at age 8, to give a full-scale IQ, FIQ, measurement. The final results, which combined data from 1,881 individuals individuals showed a positive association between IQ at age 8 and lifetime manic features at age 22 to 23. Individuals who scored in the top 10% of manic features had a mean childhood IQ which was almost 10 points higher than those scoring in the lowest 10% of manic features. The association between IQ and manic features appeared to be strongest for verbal IQ, VIQ.